Next question, why do we navigate younger, um, how, how do you navigate younger generation uh, employees that state they're not gonna do anything outside of their roles? Um, I had interns that refused to do anything other than give therapy, although their roles required file creation and data entry. So boring stuff, right? <laughs> um, great question. So first of all, be really upfront with them. Right? Create and publish a clear job description with real requirements. And then in your job interviews, reiterate those requirements. You understand that you are going to be on call. You understand that you're going to have to work Christmas day. You understand you're going to have to work weekends, things like that, third shift, whatever it is. Make sure that that's very clear. And then set some expectations as well during the onboarding process. And then if it's an on-call thing, like there's a, like a therapist that has to be on call, maybe set up an on-call schedule if possible. So people have some free time. I, I, I know like sometimes, you know, somebody wants to go out and have a drink or something like that. Um, it's really hard if you're always on call to do that because that just feels wrong. So <clears throat> make sure that you can set up that on-call schedule if, if at all possible. And then speak to the purpose and value of the work uh, and, and how you have to, or you should want to be there for people. So that's the end of my questions. This is the course I'm talking about and we will have it below in the um, description in, the, in this, in this uh, YouTube video. Um, this, is, this is getting and keeping the team that you need. I'm gonna talk about recruiting, hiring, training and retention tactics. There's about 300 different ideas in this course. And I also talk a lot about generations and what makes them tick and why we <clears throat> all are the way that we are. So we can so we can work better together. But we'll have that link below. Please check it out. Take a look at it. Um, <clears throat> it's about three or four hours of overtime, the equivalent. That's the cost of it. And if you're short staffed, you're spending that money like you wouldn't believe anyway. So maybe get some ideas out of this course. Um, like I said, three or four hours of overtime is going to pay this bill and uh, you hopefully get some great ideas out of it. And you can always reach out to me if you've got questions on anything within the course or just reach out if you have a question as well. This is my contact information. I want you to have an awesome life by living a great story. And if you have those conversations with the people that you work with, um, that makes you more authentic, makes you more real. Um, and they really, the younger generations specifically, really appreciate that. So here's my contact information. Please reach out if you've got questions. Chris? Oh my gosh, what a fantastic session today. Thank you again so much for doing this. Folks, do check out Brenda's courses online. They are amazing. They are chock full of great tips and advice. Thank you for joining us today and we hope to see you right back here very soon. Bye now.